Hello, welcome to this quick video on how to fix those annoying pop-ups for credentials you get on Outlook 2016. So this is a really recent issue, it's like um, in the past month or so, Windows released an update for Office 2016, pretty much broke everything and it tries to authenticate with an Office, Office 365 um, portal or endpoint, something like that. So whenever you try and authenticate to your regular exchange, it messes up. It even messes up on Office 365, so I don't know. It's some new feature, but anyway, let's get to the fixes. So the first fix you actually want to do to correct this issue is going to be the registry fix, or you want to roll back the offending update. So the update that is offending is the ones that I'll list here, and you want to roll them back and go to the website down here that tells you how to do that. Alternatively, you can put in a registry key to uh, sort of exclude that Office 365 endpoint, so I'll show you where that is. So it's just under HKEY Current Users Software Microsoft Office 16.0, so that's 2016, Outlook, and then Auto Discover. You want to create a new regular D word, give it that name, exclude explicit O365 endpoint with the value of 1. So now you should no longer get those prompts for your password. All right, so if you've done that and you're still getting it, you would want to go to Exchange and make sure you've checked all your shared mailbox permissions. Like, um, do you have full permission? Are the permissions signed correctly? That sort of thing. If that's still not good, the next step you want to do is go to your Credential Manager And you'll want to look down here and find any saved credentials for mail, MS Outlook for mail that might be old and it's possible that Windows is trying to pass them through. So you just want to go down to it, remove it and just see yes. Then close, reopen Outlook, put in your current password and you should be fine. If you still find you're having issues, a good way to check is to go so what you want to do is go to your connection tray, your system tray, hold control and right click your Outlook icon and then connect, click on connection status. Here you'll see your email address, your server name, the status, protocols, encryption, that sort of thing. And if you're having trouble connecting to Outlook, if you hit reconnect, you'll see a bunch of connections trying to establish and you should be able to hopefully determine what you're exactly having issues connecting to. So it could be exchange mail, exchange directories, possibly shared mailboxes if you got them added as additional mailboxes. They may come up. All right, hopefully that was helpful. All right.